Hey guys, Sean C. Phillips here with my brand new video, and I'm now at the San Diego Comic Con, but I'm showing you guys something that's really cool that's going on outside of the convention, and this is an exclusive FYE uh, uh, pop-up store. This is only here during the San Diego Comic Con. They had this there last year as well, but I'm going to show you guys a look inside, show you guys all the exclusives, so the exclusive DVDs and Blu-rays, the convention exclusives, all that kind of stuff. This is held in the, you know, pretty much abandoned Horton Plaza Mall. There's pretty much nothing left in here. This is a really, really cool mall though. You know, like I used to remember coming here during the early days of Comic-Con, they had like a Suncoast in here, a Sam Goody, all kinds of different stores and stuff in here. So a really, really great mall back in the day, but now there's like nothing left in here at all. But gonna head inside of the FYA pop-up store and show you guys all the stuff I see inside. So we'll take a look and see what kind of stuff they have in here. They have a bunch of different exclusive stuff. These are all like the San Diego, uh, you know, exclusive sale here going on. These ones are only uh, $10 for these ones. And they have some like, um, this is a 2019 exclusive one here of Chewbacca here. That's one of the convention exclusives. There's a whole lot of you know, cool ones mixed in here. Like this one is one of the FY exclusives of Prince. And they have Pennywise here. This is another one of the FY exclusives. But there's a whole lot of stuff. As you can see, this is a pop-up all held in the Horton Plaza Mall. But I'm, like I said, going to go through all the stuff here and show any of the interesting kind of ones that are here. Here's a Carmen San Diego one. This one is a another one of the convention exclusive one. It's also from the Diamond Collection. But um, they do have some Blu-rays in here. They have some of the exclusive uh, steelbooks here. Like they have the um, Arrow Video, Last House on the Left one here, and the one of Shaun of the Dead. These are some really cool ones that are exclusive to FYE. The Iron Giant here, the FYE exclusive of Godzilla, and then Batman here. Scott Pilgrim, The Warriors. This is one of the new ones. This one just recently came out. I know there's, um, I think there's an Evil Dead 2 one releasing soon. And then they have the uh, Pet Cemetery one here, as well as the Conjuring uh, FY exclusive one. They also have um, over here a bunch of different K-pop FY exclusives over here. So yeah, there's a whole bunch of different K-pops. But some of the things that I think are new here, like they have some of these cereals, which I have not seen yet before. This Garbage Pail Kids one, Crazy Crisps cereals. These ones are really cool. They have like exclusive trading cards in here. Somewhere there is, I don't know if they have any left, there was some exclusive uh, cereal of, um, you know, Child's Play. They even have this Garbage Pail Kid uh, candy bar thing here. So that's cool. Yeah, there's two different ones. That Gilbert's Pro Kid movie, I know that's like considered like one of those like worst movies ever, but for some reason it's one of those things you, you can't like, I don't know, I always really liked it, but I like the design on these, because these are to look like the, the original cards, the way these ones look. Let's see some of the other things in here. They even have like this Gars Pearl Kid uh, energy drink stuff here. And a lot of these ones you guys can find in the FYE stores, but this thing, like I said, is a pop-up store. And then this is a cool one too. This is like a book which has like the art so it's like the card artwork in here. I always like these cards. As a kid, I liked these in there. And there was also uh, a knockoff one of these that I remember as well. I can't remember what it was. It was like it was like school, like weird stuff that happened in a school. They kind of remind me of like class at Newcomb High a little bit. And this is cool too. I've never seen a Gars Pearl Kid. Uh, at least I don't recall seeing too many of these of a Funko Pop one, and that's cool. And these ones are like the ones uh, you know from the movie. Like I said, I really like that movie. I know it's like really ridiculous and goofy. Then they have some Rick and Morty shirts over here. And this thing is kind of like a, it's like what, what is this thing? It's like for holding cans, hold six cans. They have some Godzillas over here. Also have some vinyl, like Billie Eilish vinyl and uh, Saw, Guardians of the Galaxy, Deadpool, the, the Rugrats movie. This is one, an FY exclusive of the Goldbergs Mixtape Volume 1. It is? Yeah. Are you sure? This is FYE. Let's see any of the other ones. They have like some Bob Ross cereals. Well, they have a lot of these different ones. <laughs> like, yeah, the Bob Ross cereal and Bob Ross energy drink. Let's see any other ones. Bob Ross Funko Pop. Also a Bob Ross, um, like, fleece blanket. It's another one that has like, choose your own Bob Ross bobblehead painting. You can like put your own painting kind of thing in there, I guess, like switch out the ones. They have some stuff promoting SpongeBob, because now SpongeBob's 20 years old, which is kind of crazy that it's that old. I feel like, to me, SpongeBob was kind of like the last, like, of the classic, 
you know, Nickelodeon animated films, like, you know, animated shows. It kind of, to me, has that, like, one of the last of those kind of ones. They have a bunch of different SpongeBob Funko Pops here. They have a big one of this as well. I saw that in Comic-Con they're selling, like, a much, I think, pretty sure it's, like, a larger one of this one. One here of Patrick and Squidward. And I know, too, they're releasing, like, a big collection of, like, I think, like, the first 200 episodes or two, 200, like, of the best episodes of SpongeBob. Let's see, there's a bunch of different uh, Star Wars over here, uh, Funko Pops. This one's like one of the Loot Crate exclusives. So it's cool they have a whole bunch of these different exclusive ones in here for different kind of convention exclusives, Loot Crate exclusive ones. And there are some like Lion King ones over here, Lion King shirt. But here's, this is the one I was saying, the, the Good Guy Dolls cereal one. I don't know if they have any more of these ones left in here. A bunch of different um, backpacks over here. Let's see any of these ones. And these are really cool here. These are some of their, um, you know, FY exclusive ones. I don't, yeah, these are convention exclusive ones here. And this one they had last year, I remember. This is a really cool, like, split down the middle, middle um, you know, reptile one here. And these are as well, I've seen these ones that are like a balloon dog that has, like, the insides like this, like the bones and everything. And this is a small one too, of a split down the middle uh, SpongeBob. These are like the blind box ones, where it's kind of like a mystery of which one of these ones would be in here. Let's see any other interesting stuff in here. And these are kind of cool. These are like some kind of a giant, like um, kill, or kill cat thing. I don't know what this is. If it's real, Kit Kat's in here. It's like a spice. I know it's a figure thing in here. So these like figures in these Kit Kat kind of container things. They even have a small one down here. I don't know what the toy looks like in here. These are cool though. These are $40 for these ones, $129 for the larger ones. And then this thing here, a Gary Baseman uh, toys. Here, Gary, Gary Baseman. These ones, these ones I've never seen as well. I think these ones are, yeah, these are new ones as well. So it's an exclusives. It's another random Pennywise over here. They also have some uh, skate decks here, like the Big Lebowski. And these ones I saw are some cool horror toys over here. This uh, Nightmare on Elm Street, Freddy Krueger one. There's another one. I don't remember seeing this one. I don't know. It says 2018, but I don't remember seeing this. They have Invisible Man one. And then they have Child's Play, the, uh, you know, the Scream Factory Blu-ray of that one. Because I know the director, uh, you know, the writer of this, uh, Don Mancini, was, I believe, signing in here. And I think he was signing the uh, cereal box that I was mentioning. And they also have in here some little It. Uh, you know, the blind box ones. Here, like a uh, figure of the nun from the Conjuring universe. And then they have a Texas Chainsaw Massacre thing here of Leatherface. I know I've seen that one. And then a bunch of different horror pops here, like Krampus, The Witch, Halloween, then some Living Dead doll ones. See any other interesting stuff over here. Some Game of Thrones stuff over here, like Game of Thrones uh, replica props. They even have these Friday the 13th Jason Live socks. These things are cool. I've ne definitely never seen those ones. Let's see any other things to see in here. Don't want to miss anything. They also have some Marvel things. This is an interesting set. These are like the UK releases here. The, the, yeah, these are the UK ones that have, you know, um, the Iron Man 3 movie collection here, as well as this one. It's another UK release of, um, you know, Thor, Thor Dark World, and Thor Ragnarok. So that's kind of cool. They have these ones in here. This same with this one, the Captain America set. It's another one of the uh, UK ones here as well. They also have, like, an Avengers uh, game thing here. Some pops. And these ones are 75% off, 50% off of these ones. Let's see any of the other stuff over here. Like I said, I'm not seeing any of the Child's Play ones. I think that one has sold out, that Child's Play cereal. Because I, like I was saying, I know they were doing like a signing of that. So I bet that one went when everyone was coming for that. And then some of these ones I saw last year, they have like, um, this is like a Funko, like, it has like a record thing inside of this one. These are really, yeah, record here. That's kind of cool. They have one of Kiss. But it has a little Funko pop pocket inside of there, a Joker, a Joker, Joker cereal, a uh, Stay Pop Marshmallow Man one. I really like these ones. This one's really cool. This alien one, you know, with the alien in there. That's actually really cool. And that has a Funko uh, exclusive pop in that one as well. All these ones are uh, $7.99. Like I said, a number of these things you guys can find, you know, in on the website as well. 
I thought it was cool just to come in here and do a video and show all this kind of stuff. And they have like the one Alita here. That one comes out on Tuesday to Blu-ray, which I can't wait. I really, really like that movie a lot. I thought that was a really, really cool movie all around. Like everything about that I really liked. They have like these um, one here of the Ewok, and that's a, that's a cool one set. And there's a bunch more uh, Star Wars in here, and some random ones like another exclusive one. This is an Entertainment Earth exclusive, a Betty Boop here. But yeah, like I said, just wanted to give you guys a little overview look at all the stuff that's in here and some of the exclusives. I see a Nightmare on Elm Street Freddy over there. They even have some kind of necklaces here, like Star Wars themes, like necklaces and jewelry and that kind of stuff. As well as a bunch of different pins here, like they have Nickelodeon, you know, log, reptile bar, a pin, Rick and Morty one, Spider-Man, the Avengers ones here. Yeah, so a whole lot of different stuff here. But yeah, like I said, just want to give you a full like overview of this place and some really, really cool stuff, some Stranger Things stuff over here, like the soundtrack, some throw blankets. But yeah, really, really cool uh, pop-up only, you know, here for Comic-Con. So anyway, though, guys, thanks so much for watching. Like I always say, if you guys enjoy my videos, definitely give this video a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys later.